Hello and welcome back to our excuse to play Walking on a Star Unknown. I'm Kate. I'm Price, and we're looking at this green balloon. And balloon. Actually, don't think. Oh, okay. We just went into <laughs> oh. Eddie's crutch. <laughs> oh. Whoa. I actually didn't think Wait. that there'd be anything. Oh, 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 one more time. <laughs> oh. Maybe, maybe one more time. <laughs> maybe. <laughs> Stop it. Just go inside. <laughs> the Grinch circus. <laughs> um, okay. I actually didn't know that you just have to the walk fuck? over the balloon to go to the circus. Okay, the kid cool. is fine. Hi. She's happy now. Your bones are my bones. Am I right, kids? What the <laughs> heck is this? Grand Circus is so fun, you'll forget all about your death. Join the troop? Uh -oh. Okay. Um, I am the sure. balloon man. Take a look, see? Take a look, see? My face is about to burst. Yeah. Are these all ghosts? I'm scared. <laughs> hey, hello? Can yeah, you probably talk? they're all ghosts. Hey, how? Whoa, whoa. No, I don't think. Oh. Okay. They're all dead. I'm Spring Clown. Boy, we're gathering trash. <laughs> um, good. We have a lot of trash. Ooh, we have lots of trash. Hey, right? can can I give you more? What was that? Ooh, I received stuff for trash. Tofu. Tofu. Cool. How did you get tofu? Are these all tofu people? He's I the guy. I don't know. Trash sure is delicious. Hello. They eat trash. We live. We oh live, my goodness. We live by eating the tiny souls that dwell in trash. Okay. We're dead. All right. Okay, good to know. Hello. <laughs> hey. <laughs> that was a cute girl who just came to the to join the troop. Oh, she joined. Okay. Oh. I want to be a clown soon. Cool. Uh, Why are they locked up? <laughs> oh, you no. Red Circus is not alive. Good to know. What is this circus? <laughs> <laughs> Go home, dude. Okay. They're gonna stay there until morning. Are you also selling trash? Oh. We despise soldiers. They cut not through innocent selling people. Trash. Or exchanging. Sorry. They take trash. Yeah, they're taking. Oh. Uh, this is the circus, but what is this? More circus? I guess we want to yeah, go in. Two circuses. Uh, oh, 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 oh. Hey. Good evening. I'm the ringleader in Heed I am. Is the circus you to your liking? Apologies, this girl is auditioning for and he into the troop. I cannot attend to your heats now. She's showing promise. She'll sure he be taking part soon. Oh. Hello. Okay. <laughs> Uh, she was so happy. Okay. Oh. Uh, oh, uh, burgers. Whoa, 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 whoa. With woods. What? We bring people from the outside, what? but earlier one we brought in from with woods ran away. Where did he go? I think he's the one who's afraid. <laughs> oh. <laughs> the ringleader yelled at me again. Do I got no talent? I can't see because of my pumpkin You're a head. pumpkin. I'm always tripping over myself, and I get yelled at everything. Yes, sir. <laughs> <laughs> you what don't even this? know the ringleader. Okay. Yeah, me neither. What? Welcome to the show tent. Yes, would you like to see the sad tale of the clown who makes people laugh? Watch. Understood. That's kinda sad. Okay. It reminds me of Joker. Long, long ago, when this planet was still at war, the circus came to a cold forest. And one night, by coincidence, some soldiers made camp very close by. Ah, behold them. The soldiers are cold and hungry, and how sad they look. Oh there, clown. Clown whose duty is to make us laugh. Make who- make we- make we who are starving cold. And sad and <laughs> laugh. Mikwihu. Mikwihu. That's your job, isn't it? Yes, with pleasure. Take a look at me. Please laugh. Please laugh. 
<laughs> ah, how'd you fall? What hole? What so hole? <laughs> As expected of the clown whose job is to make us laugh, how very cheerful you are. Thank you. By the way, who will He's you be? Stretching his face. <laughs> we are soldiers that who protect hurts. this planet from starlings. I know we will show you what our job is well. A soldier's job is to kill, a soldier's job is to kill, and they're dead. Oh, oh, oh my goodness. He was beheaded, dude. <laughs> they proceeded to <laughs> slice of everyone. everyone else in the circus troop. Nice. The soldiers were able to procure plenty of food and drink and live their lives happily. The clown certainly wasn't hungry. The end. Why are they clapping? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> um, that was so sad. All right then. Uh, please wait a well, moment. You did not pay clown. for the show. Okay. Oh my god. What if I don't? All right, it's just five. What if you don't? You will not pay. Yeah. Will I die? Don't. Please do pay. Definitely won't pay. You are just the same as the <laughs> soldiers. I see. Oh. Let's also be fine. Uh -huh. We did not want to do this either. All of your money was stolen. How dare! Okay, I'm going back! Yeah, we're paying. Here you go, pay. Thank you very much. Yes, please do come back again. Thank you. Okay. Oh. Um, My phone just dropped. I guess that's all we need from the circus. <laughs> I just love that. I love that animation. Stop it! I can't! I needed it to exit! I wonder... <laughs> You're making everything sexual. Is this...? Ooh. Is this who I think Hi. it is? Oh. Is that Desmond? So here Ooh, you who are. Who the hell is that? Desmond. How are you faring? Hmm. You came, old foggy. Spry as ever for your age. They both have horns. Yeah, maybe they are from the same planet. planet. No need for concern. Defeat is inconceivable for me. Though there is an opponent I can't let up on. Oh, oh I see, I see. No matter what, you are a war god. You really seem to enjoy having a go with someone, don't you? Of course, I devote myself to fighting. Besides, it may be the last time I'm able to what? have a fight like this. What? 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 At any rate, don't worry about me. Things are all progressing well. What? He's plotting. Oh. So, you should return home soon. A primary god primary can't god. his seat for too long. Ebenezer. Ebenezer. Ebenezer? I don't know. Oh, I know that. I know. Then I'll comply and take my leave. Best of luck, our war god. Bring back a drink as a souvenir. Hmm. Very well then. I'll bring only the finest alcohol for the megalopolis. I see. So there are like a lot of gods. What the hell was the old man? It is I'm your bro. Tell me everything. Stop plotting. <laughs> oh, how strange to meet here. <laughs> you won't find ingredients here, yes? What in the world are you doing? Well, no, what were you was doing? <laughs> who, was, who was that dude? Or we were just walking. <laughs> we were just walking here. <laughs> I'm kind of curious <laughs> about the main god of Megalopolis. So. Yeah. Just ask him. I'll ask. Hmm. You were watching? Eavesdropping is a bad habit. That old Fogius, Evinizir, the main god of my planet, Megalopolis, though he looks senile, he's powerful. But our planet no longer has any people who believe in gods. It's but a meaningless title there. Is that, is that what he's gonna wish for? You really like pairing any with guys. I mean, they're friends. Not <laughs> they're just bros being bros, dude. <laughs> Let them be. Let's turn three. What is this? The wedding. 
All right, the wedding ring. The wedding ring. The wedding ring. Remember, the wedding ring. The wedding ring. The wedding ring. Price. The wedding ring. The wedding <laughs> ring. The wedding ring. The is yeah. The wedding ring. Yo, dude, you you left your wedding ring. Still, I never thought I'd see the day when Toph accepted us. Toph and Dios are both important people to me. It makes me happy for them to get along. Um. Yeah. Finally. Uh. I'm such a klutz. It must have been. It, it must have happened then, and I dropped it in the mines. Oh dear! What if it was broken? You mean this ring? Why? Yes. You found it for me. Thank you very much. How should I repay you? Truly, truly, you've saved me. I need to thank you somehow. I know. If you would, please accept our family's, del family's delicious spicy meal recipes. Chili fish pie and jelly hot Chili hot <laughs> <laughs> Well, we learned Eddie's chili hot today. <laughs> <laughs> Just move on already. It's not that sexual. Oh, yes. Chili hot meat. Hey. Oh, hi, Dami. What are you doing? Uh, masters. So, the judging for today is over. Good work, Nabi. By the way, have you two seen the manager of the Nabi Robo House anywhere? Haven't seen him in a while. He must feel responsible about the explosion this morning, Nabi. If you see him anywhere, tell him to come back and that nobody's mad at him. Alright. Well, let's look for the manager. Huh. There's a notice on the door. Let's see. The manager is currently out. We apologize for the inconvenience. Where could Corm be? Let's find the manager and Corm. And Corm. I actually wanna wanna find this guy. What if we talk friend. to Top again? <laughs> <laughs> you are no. tickling me. <laughs> we sold the ring. Okay, is this where she lives? Hi. <sighs> Can't my predecessor come by to visit sometimes, even if she's retired and all? Huh, <sighs> you two? Did you maybe come to visit me? <laughs> so H A P P Y. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and I gotta say, your meal today was excellent. To be honest, I couldn't do stuff this- Wait, I couldn't do this stuff at all. Oh. Huh. But like, most gods are normally like that, okay? This was just special. Special? So special. Shush. Sasquatch. Yeah, he old. is a special kid. He's a special boy. <laughs> hey, it's you. Good evening. Did you return the ring to my- Sold it. Yep. <laughs> Thank you for today. <laughs> I'm sorry I had to see such things. But I feel like I've matured a little bit myself. Now to say that's my reason, but I forewent giving the criminal's death. Exile seems appropriate though. Exile. Ooh, cool. You're getting my Just for talking. I'm like giving you my meat. friendship. It looks awful. Yes. It doesn't look appetizing at all. Here comes it the meat. <laughs> it looks like a foot. Look at it. Yeah, it do. It'll be looking like a foot. Here comes my meat, dude. <laughs> you eat <laughs> eat it. King of the blue. Yeah, here's the eat chili hot meat. Chili it looks like meat. a foot. I learned it from your sister. Yeah. My sister, <laughs> I see, she does a very soft spot for meals laden with spice. Munch, munch. Mm, it's too spicy for me, but I bet spice lovers will this they'll probably like too it. Too spicy. <laughs> <laughs> this is the meal that brute uh, oh. that Dios cooked to win the tournament five years ago. Oh, cool. I'm sure it must be a dish full of memories for those two. Treat this recipe with care. I'm giving everyone my meal. Cool. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you two are entering. I think that's his, like, oh, staple. Oh, other stuff? Uh, 
Yeah. What about the reason? Oh. I I I don't think we did we already read this. Did we already? No. It's in a million pieces. Know. Thinking of it now, it wouldn't have been surprising if we died there. In that sense, we were lucky. How optimistic can you be? Uh, your Majesty, our optimism is why we landed on a peaceful planet. Flip your thinking, dude. <laughs> <laughs> or you can say it's the law of attraction, eh? <laughs> we're super happy because we're Aww. always to be. <laughs> is it now? Talking to you is making my head hurt. <laughs> Too much information, tough can it. Tangle. <laughs> anyway. Good luck on the cooking, going by your theories. If you want to win, you can win, correct? Yep. Yeah, that what that's what it means. We'll prove to you our notions aren't just made up. Yep. And I'll give you more of my meat next time. Oh! Oh! Corm's here. here! Hey, that was convenient. Here you go, sir. I'm paying my debt for the month. Oh. Please accept it. Oh. Hmm. Hey, a corm? I've told you again and again, but I really don't mind about your... Hey now, I won't let you say that. A parent's step is their child's step, and I'll pay it back in full. Er, but think about... think about it. Duh. It's been three years now since they died in an accident, right? Duh. Oh. So he didn't chop them. Yeah. <laughs> You're so <laughs> Come on, Mark. What are you saying? I've always done this for myself. Are you okay? I mean, it's better to have money matters holding you back with longtime acquaintances, right? Yeah, that's true. True. If you don't marry, I yeah. intend to look after you in your old age. So think as think of it as a capital for them. Ooh. Jeez, you. All right, all right. I admit defeat. I'll accept this. Oh, oh, Dad. <laughs> I'm glad. And make sure you're saving up for. Okay, Dad. Okay, Daddy. Oh my goodness. They're dads now. You know, Hello the there. Better. Good evening. Uh, of course I'm serious. He had a kid. It'll be a different story, but they're. They lack parents and children. I've got to sell yes. artifacts. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Let me sell artifacts with an ancient talisman. A. It's called the crow. Hmm. Eight hundred. So. Yes. Do I have anything else? Ancient flute and mystery arrowhead. Can I get potatoes? Nope. Dictators. Dictators. Sorry. It makes me... I like the birds. I like the <laughs> birds too. They're like drooling. <laughs> oh, a weird <laughs> robot came here. Going to jump or what? Jesus Christ. Oh. Uh, Don't jump, dude. You're a robot. <laughs> you're a robot. Don't you jump. You'll get busted. Oh no, you're gonna Hi. jump. Don't jump. Ah, customers. Good evening, Navi. What brings you here? Eh, uh, you were looking for me? Ah, uh, I see. So another Navi robo asks you to Navi. It's not like I'm just worried about the explosion today, Navi. It goes deeper than that. Hey, customers. Would it be okay if we had a confidential talk for a bit, Navi? I'll listen. Yes, I'll listen. Thank you, Navi. Please don't fall asleep listening. <laughs> <laughs> I like how that is concerned. <laughs> it's okay. I slept like early. Or <laughs> centuries ago, we left our home planet of Mekarobo and traveled freely through the cosmos, Navi. But one day, a small meteorite hit our spaceship's engine and we crashed on this planet. Is that what happened to us? I forgot. Yeah, I think so. The impact of the crush. The crush? Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> the meteorite just fell in love with the spaceship. <laughs> Left our ship completely and utterly destroyed, Navi. 
so we reluctantly had to stay on this planet until we could repair our spaceship. From then on, we fought, we did our jobs, anything to save up the money to fix our spaceship. And then, just as we saved up enough and were going to repair the ship, I heard a rumor from an alien that our planet of Mecha Robo had been hit by an asteroid and wiped out. It was hard to believe. Oh, that's so sad. At the time, all the others were off at work, so I was the only one who heard it, Navi. So I... While everyone was away, I threw all the money everyone had saved in the river, sparing nothing. Because if our ship is never fixed, we'll never go home. If we never do, they won't have to grieve, Navi. Each time we nearly meet repair costs, I break a charger and waste it. I've done it a dozen of times, Navi. I feel bad for my friends, but I don't have the courage to tell them the truth, Navi. Thanks for listening. Tomorrow, I'm going to keep doing my best at the Navi Robo House. Here, take this, Navi. You're the only ones I've ever told this to in every world. Spring feathers. Don't. Uh, don't jump, dude. I'm sorry about your planet. But. I think you should tell <laughs> them, though. Oh. Jump. Right, right, right. Eto, eto, nani. What? Whispering brother. Okay. The town in the sky I got to is beyond your reach. As you had first repelled the harmful flowers, do this and I shall offer further assistance. We don't know how to do that you yet. You mean the red flowers yep. on the further right side? Yep. I forgot the place. The interior kills. Bado's gone. And do we have to find a Bado? ladder? Hey, what is this? Oh, that's what the oh. confetti-like stuff. This is beautiful. Hey, hello. Account of a certain spy. Read it. One year had passed since the Starlings invaded. At the time, I was infiltrating the Starling base as one of their mercenaries. It was completely uneventful when suddenly the Starlings stationed in the base began to suffer from severe headaches and nausea. A pain like my brain's being tampered with, that's how they described it, groaning in pain. They all fled from the base one after the other, and unbelievably they began jumping off a cliff. A cliff near the base. <laughs> they even took off the armor to guarantee death. Those who somehow kept their senses uh, had returned to Megalopolis the next morning. Even if the war ends, I'll never forget those faces that were devoid of emotion. Pong get a pong. Do you know Pong Pong? The old man next door suddenly asked me that. Why do you know Pong Garapon? I asked, my voice cracking. Then the old man said with a laugh, Why do I can't tell? I can tell when. I can tell. I can tell. <laughs> with one look at with your one face. one look at your face. <laughs> Overcome with emotion, I shouted, Ah, Master! After this, I visited Master's house every day. He was bored and he gave me soldier, soldier massages. <laughs> <laughs> and let him pet his cat. <laughs> After his master's death, I took in his cat. Master had serious dementia and his family wouldn't take the cat. I wonder what Pongerapon was. Uh, I muttered and the cat purred. Huh, so that's what it was. The cat? What? About Raven. I think so. The I Raven? Raven? I didn't get it. <laughs> the Raven are a people whose ancestors were avians called crows. Yeah, known for black wings on their heads and backs, and they grow in various different intelligence support <laughs> of forming groups. They can also be <laughs> very <Lazy exclusive>. <laughs> Ravens are yeah, pretty nice. Mayflow. Oh, we're learning about birds because Bado the bird. <laughs> yeah. People whose ancestors were spirit like beings, known for being very pale and relatively small. Born weak with a weak constitution. Yes, double weak. It said the majority of them died. Okay. Yes. Interference from aliens and their. Yes. Flugel. Flugel people are whose ancestors were winged bugs called dragonflies. They're found in Cyrene and Aluda. Known for wings so thin to appear transparent, uh, growing on their heads or backs. 
Um, they're adaptive to environmental changes. Their personalities are often eccentric and they can be stubborn. Notes of Weistock Miner. It's been three years since I left. Right now I'm digging and I'm digging and there are all types of aliens and I'm digging. Gotta wonder though, <laughs> is that rumor about them being warrior species true? They're so gentle and nice. Base ruins. First I burned away all of the spiky plants. Oh, so that's how uh, we're gonna... Burn it. Yeah. Uh, but they're terrifyingly persistent. Not long after being burnt, they grow back. Okay, after following the road, uh, starting base, two mo uh, two air can't breathe, they're breathing, are they alive, something is wrong with life, yes, help me, I'm going nuts, I'm a living being, there, are they two, nope, that's right, on the way here there was a cliff that looked just right, I'll try going there now, after reading why, all that, why is everyone <laughs> like going to the cliff, hello Bado, huh. Yes, the planet Shoka is holding a surprising national track meet. That sounds like fun. Hmm. Oh, good evening. Sorry I didn't notice you there. I'm reading the Cosmos Times. It's, it carries news from various planets and is quite interesting. They also said the guards from Cyrene are gone. Well, there, evening, you be True. careful. We're excited about getting a new sibling soon. You came to see the fully automatic diamond, didn't you? Yay. Of course I did. Um, yeah, sure. Of course you did. That? Ain't he one big honking unit? Big as the Mount Fuji. He's a little brother to us. Um, who? Yo, me the Reno. I don't know. Do you know anything about whatever that was? Oh my oh. god. <laughs> he is big. Kitty, me. But he is the little brother. Yeah. <laughs> Wait, were you Midorino or was I Midorino? I forgot. Maybe I am Midorino. Maybe you are. Curious about that machine? That's my latest invention. It'll be done real soon. I call it the fully automatic diamond. It's a powerful cleaning bot that'll clean up the dirtiest room in no time. Good to know. Cool. Thing is, I'm sure oh. about five cucumber sea ores to finish it. Wonder if they'll if they sell them. Where are the soldiers? Yo, go home. Hey, soldiers. Time to return to castle. No leaving behind. One, two, three, three, four, five, six, oh, seven. The count's off again! Who's crying with me? In the name of the moon, I'll punish you! That's a sailor moon. Oh my reference. goodness! <laughs> That's a sailor moon. <laughs> Is the parasol still here? Yep. But the ghost was delivered to the circus, so it's fine. Anything new? I'll just be fishing. I'll be fishing. And while I fish, I would like to thank you guys for watching this video. It's been a nice day. Price and I were just chilling. And we'll continue this. Ooh. And we'll continue and, this. Oh, what, what was that? Ancient gunpowder. Anyway, we'll continue this in the next episode. Thank you! Bye! Bye.